But right now, we're joined by a pretty special guest. Well, he's one of the biggest movie stars in history. Top Gun, Jerry Maguire, Mission Impossible. I would name them all, but would be here all night. Welcome, Tom Cruise. Thank you very much. Thank you, Julie. Thank you for having me. Thank you for having me. Fancy seeing you. Fancy seeing you. You look lovely. Thank you very much, absolutely lovely. Um... There are some very delighted people in Windsor this evening because you walked here. Um, you came through the town, met everybody. Yeah, it was lovely. Yeah. It's lovely. This is a wonderful, wonderful event. I'm very honoured to be here. It's a real privilege. What made you say yes to this one? Well, how, how can you... No, I was just very honoured at the moment. I mean, she's just a, a woman that I greatly admire. I think she's someone who has tremendous dignity, and I admire her devotion. Uh, what she's accomplished has been historic. Mm -hmm. And I just remember always as a kid, you know, seeing photos of her, and I've traveled around a lot as a, as a kid, and I came to England. I started making movies here in 1982. And I started, when I started producing movies, even before I just brought them here to England, because I like their crews and the people and... The generations of family that I've worked with these crews and I love the history and uh, I just have great respect for her so when they asked I instantly said you yeah, know be my honor to be here but you could hardly get a more British occasion I know it's how lovely. are you anticipating this being in that arena oh, it's, it's extraordinary it's, 4,000 people there already and it's wonderful well, it's really it's uh, I, I really love the tradition yeah and what a moment well you are what going a to moment. get a moment tonight because you are uh, introducing the King's Troop yes. Royal Horse Artillery and they are fast yes. I mean, you, to, to be that close to it is going to be quite extraordinary I've seen them on television before and I, but I've never seen them in person so I'm really looking forward to seeing them mm -hmm. looking forward to being part of this and not, not a bad backdrop really <laughs> no, no not bad at all that's a lot of history there, a thousand years yep. the kitchen's been open for a thousand years that's a good restaurant yeah. in there yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I hear. Yeah, very you, good. You speak of her, your admiration for Her Majesty the Queen. What do you think she means to the people of the US? I mean, very famously, she she rode her horse in the grounds here with Ronald uh, Reagan in the 80s. She's been backwards and forwards. She's met so many of your presidents in her lifetime. Presidents, world leaders, people of all walks of life. I think that uh, not just America, but the world knows as I said, dignity mm. and devotion and, and kindness. Uh, someone who I think that's what we, well, I've always felt about her. But someone that understands her position and held it with, mm. through a history that's just been extraordinary the mm. past 70 years. Well, you um, met her husband, the, the yes. Duke of Edinburgh. What did you talk about? That was lovely. I, I, I was at a charity event that I was asked to go and speak at, and so there was a moment he and I had. We were, of course, talking about pilots, you know. So we had to talk about helicopters, and he was telling me the wonderful story of how he got the first helicopter into Buckingham Palace during her coronation. <laughs> Fantastic story. <laughs> Fantastic story. I was, he couldn't have told you about I was like this close to going, you know... <laughs> I'd like to land a helicopter. If you ever need someone to pick you up, I've, I've got a helicopter, and I think I could put it right there, you know? Which, which brings which us Which brings us very perfectly. neatly to a moment. Because, we, uh, yeah, we, we both went to see um, Top Gun Maverick last week, and yeah. as, you know, so big fans of the original... We were, we were, but if, I'm honest, Tom. We were terrified because I thought, if I don't so like this, what are we going <laughs> to say if we didn't like it? It is incredible. incredible. It's everything yeah. you want it to be and more. And for you, um, a sort of, a, I would have thought, a very, very important movie to get right. Very. I mean, every film I make is very important, but this one, people have been asking for decades. Your family have been asking My family, to do it. I'm like, listen, and every time I'm asked, I'm like, I, I don't know how to do it. And I would lay there in bed, and I started thinking. And so for decades, I've been thinking about what could I do? What would the story be? How could I film? So you'll see in my career, there's movies that I was aerial photography, and I had a concept of how I wanted to approach it. Uh, for 10 years, I said, look, if I'm going to do it, here's the standard at which it has to be done. Here's how we have to do it. And I was developing different ideas and, and cameras and styles and figuring out how can we shoot that aerial, how can we tell that kind of story to get an audience inside these aircraft. So 
I was, I'm so happy that you're happy. <laughs> oh, That's what I want you to be oh, happy. Like I all those people that were saying he, 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 <laughs> he was so <laughs> over the top with it. It was extraordinary. <laughs> but you've talked about it as your legacy film and that it was an yes. emotional thing to go back. It is to go back to your younger self, the thing that, that made was, you, you know. How was that? It was emotional. I, I didn't, I would, you know, I was surprised. Here I am. You know, as it's the film that I went to, Paramount wanted me to make this movie for a year. And when I finally said, look, I'm going to do it. And there's just a lot of stipulations that I had back in 85 when I decided to do it. And now here we are with Jerry Bruckheimer. And he was always very generous with me as a producer, knowing my interest in cinema and just seeing those locations and feeling the responsibility. And how do we figure this out? Like, how do I do it? the tone and give the audience what they want with this character because that's why I made it I made it I made it for the fans that said and I, I there's a certain point I was like I'm either going to do it now or I'm not and I knew that certain things were enough in place for me to go and mm. jump in but also I suppose in 36 years that technology 36 has, years has, <laughs> has moved so far <laughs> forward the way you can shoot it now is so much better than the way you could have done it back yes and from from Amer I did a film called American Made, and, and Christopher McQuarrie and I did Fallout together, and from Top Gun. One of the stipulations was that I had to fly in the F-14 and be filmed in the F-14. That was part of my contract mm. back in 85. I was, I was pretty, you know... Adamant. Yeah, <laughs> cocky. I, I, mean, <laughs> I was trying to be... I know, I, I was. <laughs> yeah. And I, you know, precocious. So, um, so I was thinking what can we do to do that so I, I was I was looking and developing these cameras and developing mm -hmm. systems and engineering and I'm a pilot myself you know and I fly you helicopters fly and film, airplanes yeah. and that p-51 in the movie is my is my plane yeah is it so it would be that p-51 I was like this plane. when you open it that thing I was like oh man <laughs> I had a dream I always wanted to fly p-51 and a Spitfire yeah. when I was a little kid I wanted to make since I was four years old I wanted to make movies I wanted to fly airplanes. And now you get to present here tonight. And to be here tonight. What a way. What, what, a, what, what an amazing... What, a, what an honor. Okay. Enjoy tonight. Enjoy. Thank you. I hope I'm enjoying that every we moment. planted a little seed and that at some stage you get to land a helicopter in Buckingham Palace. That'd be fantastic. <laughs> 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 so let me do it in Trafalgar Square. I'd like to do it in Buckingham. Precisely. <laughs> Windsor, wherever they want it. <laughs> Thank you. I'll be Such the pilot. Such a pleasure to talk to you this oh, evening. And, and enjoy every moment. It's going to be quite an evening. Thank, Thank you, you for, for having speaking me. to us. Tom Thanks, Cruise. Oh, there we are.